Hey, this is Alf. Thanks for watching. I have a quick video I want to shoot for you, and I'm going to uh, play another video for you by my buddy Mike Mikalovich, the author of Profit First, Clockwork, uh, Get Different. Uh, big shout out to you, Mike. I love everything you're teaching, and I follow you closely, and I can highly suggest you guys do the same. So, in this video, he talks about actually some of the uh, what has to have the greatest impact for him. And I was so happy to hear that and, and see that video so I wanted to post it here for you too because guess what he talks exactly what I'm talking about watch his video and then come back and, and leave a comment perhaps the method that has had the greatest impact on my own performance as an entrepreneur has been establishing a peer group now there's established organizations out there there's tab which is the alternative board vistage EO entrepreneurs organization YPO, Young Presidents Organization, and others. And they're wonderful groups and organizations because they're already established and you can very quickly assemble a group to work with you as peers to improve your business. Some are facilitated, some are not. What I found there's an alternative too is for you to establish it and run it yourself. It's no cost except your time and effort. I actually do this with authors. I have an author group that I surround myself with and we meet once a year in this case, but in many peer groups I'm in, we meet once a month and we tackle uh, the challenges we have. Imagine one problem that you have, but you have eight to 10 brains working on it, different perspectives you can get. So a powerful peer group is to surround yourself with people that are in a similar space in their life's journey, in their business, and get their perspectives. Now, interestingly, I found the more diverse the group, the better. Men, women, people with different backgrounds, people with different religious beliefs, all those things change perspectives. And that way you have people going through similar experiences, maybe growing a business, but they all have different perspectives, which will open your sight um, to what is, is potential in your, what the potential is in your business and what you can do. So start a peer group and you can take the easy route of joining an established peer group. All those ones are recommended are great, or you can take the longer route, but less expensive of running your own. The greatest impact for him is being in a peer group. Another word, mastermind. So one of the things that he uh, advocates is being in the peer group, but I advocate being in uh, more than once a month, once a week actually, to get the intensity and the most uh, uh, bang for the bucks. And obviously uh, forming these mastermind groups are free to you, so there's no cost like he's saying as well. And guess what? You get about eight to 10 people working on your problem. So in my case, my ideal number is somewhere between three and six that meets frequently. And, uh, and the more diverse your groups are, uh, the better. And I am totally agreeing with him on that point as well. You'll hear me talk about that in my course as well. And uh, you get many different points of views, uh, insights, experiences, contacts to pull in the same uh, direction for you to help you with your issues. So you open the potential completely. So uh, my advice, start a peer group, mastermind, advisory board, support group, whatever you like to call it, okay, and uh, cannot uh, more highly recommend also following him. He's a smart guy. Read his book, Profit First. It will change the way you look at accounting equation where, you know, uh, <laughs> he turns it around and says sales minus profit equals expenses. Not the other way around. Not sales minus expenses equal profit. Big difference. So you pay yourself first. You pay yourself right away. So read the book, learn how to apply that system and uh, way to go. Mike, you're a great guy and uh, see you at the top. And you guys, click below, leave a comment what you think. I'd love to hear what you have to say. Cheers. Bye.